Nine months ago, we released 32 helmeted honey eaters into the forest around me near Warburton, and a high proportion of the, those birds are still present, which is a really encouraging result. And so at the moment, we're in the process of releasing an additional 18 birds and really try to create a strong honey eater neighborhood. provision of high quality suitable habitat for the helmeted honey eater is absolutely key to recovering this species. You know, more than a century ago, the majority of suitable habitat for this bird was cleared for farming. And so it's taken us a long time to locate this specific location where we think conditions are suitable. We then established soft release enclosures on site to help acclimatise the captive bred birds to the new environment before release. And then also to help them transition into their new forest environment, we have supplementary food stations established throughout the forest. Helmeted honey eaters once occupied a much larger range. Due to habitat loss, that wild population has confined to a single wild site. And this is obviously honey eaters all around me giving alarm calls. They're all congregating and there's a bit of anticipation amongst us but also amongst them. We've all worked really hard. So many people have been involved with this release and um, to see them leaving is, yeah, it's just wonderful. Thank you.